When it comes to diabetes, there is more danger than just high blood sugar levels. There's also an increased risk for heart disease, both at a younger age and with more severe symptoms. People with diabetes are at a higher risk for a stroke or a heart attack that could be fatal. So it's very important that you understand how a diabetic heart differs from a healthy heart. Diabetes causes many changes in the body that affects how energy is processed and how organs function. Now, because of this built-in metabolic risk factor, people with diabetes are at an increased risk for heart disease, even when they keep their high blood sugar levels under control. When that's combined with other risk factors like obesity, high blood pressure, unhealthy cholesterol levels, physical inactivity or smoking, you further add to your risk for diabetic heart disease. This can show up in people with diabetes in several ways. First, let's look at the arteries. Now, here and here is plaque buildup. This buildup of plaque in the arteries reduces the flow of oxygen-rich blood. This is called coronary artery disease. Now, with heart disease, the high blood sugar levels from diabetes can lead to deposits of plaque inside the blood vessel walls, like here and here. These deposits increase your chances for narrowed, hardened, or clogged blood vessels. Diabetes can damage the heart muscle, affecting its function, which is called diabetic cardiomyopathy. This can then lead to a weakened heart, also known as heart failure, and problems with heart rhythm that can bring on a stroke. Now take a look at the inside of the heart. Look all around. You can see that because of the unnatural stress, the heart muscle can thicken. Here, you can see inflammation, right? And a buildup of scar tissue caused by the muscle being overworked and stressed. Now, when this happens, and when your heart gets thick and stiff, it really can't keep up with the demand the rest of your body puts on it. The harder it tries to work, the more damage is done. And over time, the heart deteriorates. Your heart becomes very enlarged and it's weak. And this means you're in heart failure. Unfortunately, people with diabetes are two to four times more likely to have heart disease. And at least 68% of those over the age of 65 die from some type of heart disease. You know, it's never too late to get physically active, eat healthier, and reduce your stress levels. Be sure to talk with your doctor about medications that may prevent or control risk factors for heart disease.